Here's all the brand new comic book series debuting in stores for the week of September 7th, 2016. All the new net number one debut issues and any potential key issues that might sell out. Like Alters number one is the latest series from Aftershock Comics writer Paul Jenkins. There is a one in ten ratio variant for this one. Thin is looking pretty cool. It's a new mini series from American Gothic Press. Got some uh, publicity for this one. Winner of the famous Monster Silver Scream Fest Award for Best Graphic Novel. Small print run from writer and artist John Clark. Skyborne number one debuts from Boom Studios writer and artist Frank Cho on this one. Rise of the Black Flame debuts over at Dark Horse from writer Mike Magnolia. And DC gives us Cyborg Rebirth number one. This is the one shot from writer John Semper. They also give us Ever After from the Pages of Fables number one. This is a new Vertigo issue. Supergirl is relaunched with a new ongoing series from writer Steve Orlando. Bunch of variant covers. Boo, World's Cutest Dog debuts from Dynamite Entertainment. A bunch of variant covers on this one, of course. And they also give us The Great Divide from writer Ben Fisher. Heavy Metal Magazine debuts Aftermath, Big Clean, the Molen Brothers. Give us this one. And Image debuts Eclipse, a new and ongoing series from writer Zachary Kaplan. Also, Glitter Bomb debuts, also an ongoing series from writer Jim Zub. A couple different variant covers for that one. Killer Be Killed, number one. The second printing is out, sold out in advance of release. And number two is even sold out in advance of release. Walking Dead 158, as well, is sold out in advance of release. Walking Dead's been selling out every issue again. And there's two different covers for this one. Rebel, number one, debuts from Joe Books. This is unlike their typical all-ages Disney book. And this one will have a small print run. Max Ride Final Flight is the last miniseries of this uh, title from James Patterson over at Marvel Comics. Mike Wolfer Entertainment gives us Widow Progeny, and this one is sold out in advance release. There's also a sexy adult cover. Knight's Dominion over at Oni Press from writer Ted Naife. And possibly the surprise hit of the week could be Hardcore Aiken. Very small print run from Bliss on Tap. This ties in to the movie Hardcore Henry. So it could be a surprise sellout. There's all the books that we want to highlight this week. Of course, there's lots of other releases as well. Uh, regular issues. And you can get all of these at hawknesscomics.com. We're now set up to sell with uh, throughout the United States again. And of course, check out my weekly market reports at hawknesscomics.com. You can find out what comics are selling out, what to order in advance, and what the hottest back issues are in the world of comic collecting. We'll see you next week.